Hello, I'm Kiko and welcome back to Atomi Girl. So today I have filmed for you guys another sewing tutorial. Honestly, I did not expect to be uploading this week um, because I just have a lot of things going on. And right now I am in the process of applying to university. Um, and one of the programs that I want to apply to is fashion design. And quickly, I'm just going to explain to you guys my situation. I read online that you for that program you have to be 21 and over. So I'm 19. So I kind of gave up on applying into fashion design because I'm just I just don't have the age to apply into that field. And so I didn't start preparing a portfolio because when you want to apply into design, you need a portfolio. Um, so I gave up on that idea. However, I did go to their open house like two weeks ago, and I asked the people there if you actually had to be 21 and over. And they gave me a good and bad news. The good news is that um, I can apply. You don't need to be 21 and over. Um, but the bad news is that I only have a month left to prepare a portfolio of 15 works. Other works that I have been showing on YouTube are like me reworking clothes, and they're select based on your ability to like create clothes out of scratch. So what I've been doing is not really out of scratch, it's mostly just reworking clothes. So last night I was just trying to figure out like anything that it, I could create out of uh, the fabric that my grandma gave me, which is mostly cotton, but it's really see-through. So um, I really didn't know what to make and I was just like, whatever, I'm just not gonna upload this week which is really disappointing for my for my viewers and also for me so I was just like fuck it I'm just I'm just gonna try to make something so I quickly sketched out and I just wanted to make like an off shoulder and I know that there are a bunch of off shoulders tutorial out there but I added some twist and I can say that this is kind of my creation. I've never seen really anyone make something like this. So it's a very feminine, almost like princess top. And when I drew this, I was like, okay, no way is this gonna work. This is not gonna look like it at all. And I just really didn't know what this was gonna look like at the end. But I just followed my design and <clears throat> it ended up looking great. And it's probably one of my favorite one of the fa my favorite tops that I've ever created. I just really can't wait to show you guys how I made it and I can't wait to wear it. I just can't wait to show you guys how it's gonna look so let's just start the video. So I just can't wait to show you guys how to make this top. So let's just get into the video. So I just can't wait to show you guys how to make this top and I hope you guys enjoy it and let's just get so this is our main piece and I got it by um, drawing out the contour of a crop top but I stopped where the shoulders started so I didn't draw the shoulders nor the color of the top. So once you get those two pieces, sew them right sides together. Now these are the fabric for the wrist and I just cut out two small squares then I fold the two short edges together and you just sew that side down finally the last piece are the sleeves and these are gonna be larger rectangles and you fold the short edges together and you sew down the side as well now it's time to attach the sleeves to the top now lay the sleeve next to the top and you're gonna see that the top has like this curled hold because the sleeve isn't there yet. So you're gonna imitate that curled shape to the sleeve. Now lay the body inside out but the sleeves has to be right side out. And then insert the sleeve inside the body and gather the curled edges together and then you're gonna want to sew that like semi circle together now for the little rectangles for the wrist you're gonna want to turn it inside out but only half of it
So I find this part relatively fun to do. Now you're gonna want to sew the wrist to the sleeves. So you're gonna want to insert the front of the wrist inside the sleeve. And you're just gonna sew it down. And obviously you can see that the sleeve is bigger than the wrist but that's exactly what we want because we want the sleeves to look slouchy we cut out of the darker fabric two thin rectangles that are the same length of the body So I'm sewing that rectangle about 3 inch off of the center. And then I'm sewing the other side of that rectangle 3 inches off of the other side's center, <laughs> if that makes any sense. Just So now it's going to look like this from the inside. Then gather the two light rectangles that were like left out and sew them together. So it's gonna create this like kind of tube and then sew down the middle. We're gonna do the laces and I just cut down very thin rectangles of the light fabric. And by now I'm pretty sure that you guys know how to create these laces. But if you don't, you basically just fold these in two and then you sew them down and then you turn it inside out to create some laces. So now I'm gonna insert the laces inside the two tubes that I created and I'm gonna start from the bottom to the top. Oh my god, I'm so sorry for my voice, I just woke up. So once you reach the top, you just pin it down and do the same for the other side of the tube. Okay, so it has to look like this by now. And now you're just gonna hem the top and the bottom edges. But when hemming the bottom edges, I tuck the laces in because I don't want to sew those laces onto the top. So once everything is hemmed, you're just going to want to create two little holes to um, take out the two laces so we can be able to tie them. Yeah, just like this. And voila, we're done! So that's it for the sewing tutorial. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more of this. And I don't really have anything else to add. And don't forget to follow me on Instagram if you want to. Um, it's at kelly.vng. And that's about it. Um, I will see you very soon. Bye! So I don't really have anything else to add. Um, I just hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you guys very very soon. Bye!